Hello beautiful souls. Uh, I hope you all are doing well. I'm Anita Svetlana. Welcome to your reading and full moon blessings to all. So this full moon is on 12th August and it is in Aquarius, the sign of the water bearer. Uh, the water bearer is a symbol of healing and uh, transmutation. It has the gift of collecting water. That's the emotional psychic energy in the world around us. Okay. And it collects it in a vessel and it clears it using the power of the breath before returning it to the earth. So we can use the power of our breath to transform dense, heavy, negative energy or any grieving energy around us in something lighter, hopeful and more loving. It is time to make a mark on the world and, and follow your passion without compromising who you really are in order to fit into a mold or to please other people. This full moon is going to be a super full moon. Okay, in Maharashtra, we also celebrate this full moon as Nardli Purnima, also known as Coconut Day. It is an important festival dedicated to the sea god Varun. It is celebrated with great fervor by the fisher community of the western coastal region of India. During this festival, people offer coconut to the sea. Okay, and it is also believed that after this day, the strength of the wind and the direction of the wind changes in favor of fishing. It is celebrated to ward off, uh, you know, unwanted incidents while sailing in the sea. It marks the beginning of the fishing and the water trade among the fish folks. It also indicates that the coming year will be filled with happiness, joy and wealth. All right. So this full moon reminds us that there are truly plenty of fishes in the sea and that you don't need to follow other people's idea or to stay in a situation that no longer aligns you with who you really are and who you want to become. Big fish is a sorry, big fish in a small pond can offer you the illusion of power. But wouldn't it be better to be in a big pond where you get to explore the open seas and to break out of the restrictive safety of your own comfort zone this full moon asks you to push past all the self-imposed limitations to your self-expression okay this full moon will inspire you to break out from your usual boxes and liberate your soul from the emotional shackles that hold you back from being yourself it is time for you to be your authentic version of yourself, all right? It, it, sorry. it will also help you to see through the flames of your passion and tap into the bigger picture and a little bit of logical perspective as well can go a long way in making your burning desire more attainable. So look out for clarity under this full moon beam, okay? Now is the time to focus on being authentic and embracing yourself just the way you are. Okay, shake up the universe. That's the invitation of this intense action packed full moon. You will also experience an intense sense of letting go of heavy weights or burdens that, that you might be carrying. Uh, you could feel alone in the, in the spotlight, but you could also experience this with a sense of relief. What is done is done. Now the only way ahead is moving forward in life. This full moon shifts the collective consciousness towards community and collaboration. Don't let external chaos get too deep into your body and focus on practices that bring you joy. You can uh, practice meditation, spirituality, breath work, things that kind of calms your nervous system. Do the meditation which will help you feel centered, alright? You can also work with crystals like uh, opalite, moonstone, selenite and black tourmaline because they all work well with emotional uh, emotions uh, particularly when presented with challenges. Uh, allow the August full moon to keep you be feeling full and your heart overflowing with love. You, so you, you, you do have love so be open to receive that love because what will happen is you will continue to receive that love. Allow compassion to radiate from your heart during this time. 
Saturn, the Lord of Karma, is very active under this full moon. So whenever Saturn is active, it can press on us to take greater responsibilities for your action and to ensure that we are moving in accordance with our higher self. So if any action you are, you are taking are not in alignment with your soul or if you are not, uh, if you are foregoing some of your responsibilities, this full moon will bring this information into your awareness. The best way to navigate through all the energies is to remember the healing gift that Aquarius can bring. Remember that we hold the power in our breath to regulate our mind, body and emotion. We have no control over what happens in the world around us. We have no control over the events that unfold okay, in our lives. But we do have control over how we choose to show up or how we respond how we choose to handle things and what we choose to give our energy to. So make a conscious decision under this full moon to give your energy to all that fills you up. Okay, Make a conscious decision to choose to see things in ways that both honors your truth and brings you peace. Allow your heart to radiate like the moon, you know, bright and full. All right. So that's all I have about this full moon, okay? Uh, please meditate, try to do some, uh, you know, full moon activities, make some uh, moon water. So try try to uh, do at least some self-care activities during the full moon. And it is very important to practice self-care and to meditate, all right? So uh, let's move to your reading, okay? Uh, please remember that this is a general collective reading. So please pick up messages that you resonate to. Uh, don't forget to like, comment, share and sub consider subscribing as well. Uh, I mentioned the timestamps in the description. So all you need to do is choose a crystal or a group that you resonate to or that you feel drawn to. If you click on the description uh, drop down uh, and you go to the description, uh, there's a timestamp mentioned against each group. If you click on the timestamp, that will take you directly to your reading. All right. So I'll see you at your reading. So for today's reading, we have three groups as usual. Group one, group two and group three. And uh, group one is going to be this moonstone crystal. Group 2 is going to be this orange selenite and I'm going to show you a beauty. This is going to be group 3. This is a selenite palm stone. So go ahead, close your eyes and choose a crystal or a group that you're most drawn to and I will see you at your reading, alright? Welcome group one and this is for all those who resonated with this moonstone. The high priestess. Well, what a card to start with. So uh, you do know that you have powerful intuition and uh, you know you have powerful uh, psychic insights that are coming and you are receiving those uh, messages uh, you you some of you might be going or most of you might be going through an emotional situation or might be dissatisfied with your life or worry that somebody is going against you so it's time for you to do some reflection and meditation because everything that you seek you know all the answers that you seek are all within you all right and uh, you might feel you know there might be a need to defend yourself or there might uh, the, you know you might the emotional situation uh, might be because of some misunderstanding that has happened between you and someone or you feel that someone is is working against you okay uh, or you have a two two faced friend or you know you're involved with somebody who is stubborn or aggressive you know let go let go the need to be right okay just focus on yourself reflect on what is it that you're going and you will find the answers 
you know within yourself in case uh, you are going uh, some of you might be involved with uh, uh, you know with the law or you know there must be some uh, court case going on so you need to pay attention to that as well and focus what is it that you want to do and uh, you need to be uh, true to yourself first and uh, to others as well all right and you will find that peace you know once you find your answers you will find that peace you know you will be at peace you are searching for that peace so you will find that so right the world uh, a very happy ending uh, so so whatever situation you're going through there will be a happy ending there will be an ending of a cycle okay uh, coming full circle spiritual growth and insight and like i mentioned in the first card you do have a lot of insights and downloads that 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 you're getting you are getting a lot of messages you just need to tune yourself and you know uh, take action on those messages take that leap of faith on those messages and life is going to be beautiful also whenever archangel michael comes up in a reading okay uh, it means it is time for you to let go of all uh, negative beliefs or everything that doesn't serve you any purpose and let go of your fear let go of anything that is not serving you any purpose anymore so it is time for you to cut cords with all those uh, things or all, all the negative behavior that you have or you know your fears that uh, that you have it is time for you to let go of that all right let go of those fears those worries or those stressful situations nine of aerial your dreams are fulfilled this this okay fine this is a wish fulfillment card okay there's a rainbow that is there as well this and the unicorn so this is a wish fulfillment card your dreams are fulfilled hard work leads to great success a love for beautiful things in life <coughs> so sorry so all your wishes are going to be fulfilled like i mentioned earlier life is going to be beautiful and you just need to think positive it is when you think positive you think about positive outcome and positive possibilities that is when it will actually happen okay and uh, you know you might be going through a lot of this stuff right now you know a lot of activities happening right now but stay focused you know that your dreams are going to come true you know that all your desires are going to come true so stay stay focused okay and move forward with that focus in life and you know some of you might be at a crossroad also you know trying to make choices you know you because of a situation that you're going through you don't know what choice to make but it is best for you to make a choice and take that decision that is the reason you need to go within and and you know reflect and review your situation and look at that situation from a different perspective that is when you'll be able to make that choice and you will be able to take that decision the magician what else do you require wish fulfillment magician so you are currently surrounded with uh, this inner magical energy of manifestation it's like whatever you touch will turn to gold the midas touch that we say so whatever you need will magically uh, appear and uh, this card is also about new beginnings it's successful new beginnings so you do have new beginnings also coming into your life and that can be with any aspect of your life where you are looking for a new beginning all you need to do is just get a practical plan for your dreams and take action take that decision that that you are not able to take that decision you 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 do have the energy of manifestation which is which is surrounding you right now you are surrounded by that energy so so use that energy wisely peace so like i mentioned your first card you are looking for, the, for 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 peace but for that you need to free yourself from all the drama that you are involved in you need to stop fighting first of all stop fighting with yourself okay stop fighting and allow yourself to rest for a while 
okay when you let go of what you no longer need when you let go of what you no longer need you will make room for peace okay and you know you don't need to get involved with drama every time you can still have a peaceful resolution for for the situation that you're going through refuse to engage in any drama with people around you you don't need to give in to other people's desire for drama discernment so you need to take care of the choices like i mentioned earlier you know you might be uh, at a crossroad where you must you might be deciding what choice to make so make a choice wisely uh, you know uh, you might be going through a situation where, where, where you uh, you were not able to see the uh, see the truth of the situation but when you do when you review the situation that you're going through you know things will unfold and the truth will be revealed to you all right and you need to examine that uh, you know carefully and closely the path so the uh, this card is about you know your uh, the way is open for you okay the path is already lit if you see all all you need to do is take that step forward and there is this door there's this light beyond beyond this you need to step into the light and you need to respond and take action now and start your journey to towards what you want you need to be courageous and take that step forward and be open and uh, you know responsive for the things that are coming into your life and the changes that are coming into your life purity so you need to look for simple clean solutions you need to understand why you are doing what you are doing okay and be very clear in your communication so that you know there are no miscommunication no misunderstanding in your relationship keep your intention pure and whatever you do intend for the highest good that is what this card is about okay so have uh, you know uh, think about the highest good not only about for yourself but everybody who is uh, involved in the situation <clears throat> meditate and contemplate you have uh, you had the meditation card right in the beginning as well that you need to meditate because that is going to give you a lot of answers and that is going to give you a lot of insight it is time to release negativity and this is what i mentioned when i mentioned uh, when i spoke about archangel michael card it is time for you to release everything that doesn't serve you any purpose it is time to re release your fears as well so so do that uh, uh, you know cut cords with situations with people with everything that doesn't serve you any any purpose yeah work through your fears so you need to work on your fears and release those fears that you have you need to let go of your fears expect powerful changes and i think i did mention that earlier as well let's see what are the blessings that are going to come for you this full moon so psychic ability you need to trust your intuition that was your first card you know high priestess where you need to trust your intuition and, and it was all about intuition a path of money is waiting for you to to find it strong emotion passion sorry passionate love or uh, hate so you might have extreme emotions going on P please keep control over your emotions uh, career focus on your career so you will have changes might be some of you might have changes in your career as well position of authority so you might be dealing with someone in a position of authority or you might uh, uh, get a position of authority or some promotion that might be coming your way you have protection from a powerful friend and 
you have great happiness coming in all right so that's all i have for you group one i hope you resonated to this reading and this messages and i will see you next time for your next reading thank you welcome group two and this is for all those who resonated with this orange selenite as you're reading empress so it's time to act upon uh, your plan and uh, you know take be courageous and take that step forward because you are going to be successful so uh, professionally also you are going to be successful in, in anything that you you take up right now uh, you uh, this this group might be your creative uh, lot where you know you are uh, creative and your creativity will be rewarded uh, you do have luxurious and abundant resources that are going to come to you and you will get uh, you know success will 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 come to you okay you need to have some self control and uh, patience also uh, uh, remember that your plans are working out very well right now you are going to have professional and financial success and uh, remember to use your resources wisely ace of gabriel so you do have a new beginning card and you know uh, this this wonderful opportunity that is going to uh, come uh, to you and uh, it brings the promises of passion opportunity inspiration and it is time for you to take action okay it's a time for you to move forward like i mentioned here you need to have that courage to move forward and uh, you do have great changes coming into your life but don't hesitate okay take that step forward you know some of you might be offered a new job or some of you might get a promotion this is your chance to do something really amazing uh, you might uh, some of you might get uh, you know opportunities for new adventure so so you know welcome and accept those opportunities with open arm okay some of you in this group might even start your own business venture all right and this you might have some new beginning coming into your life so remember that as well so be open to the new energies that are coming into your life 10 of aerial so there is so much uh, that you have in your life to be grateful for so please practice gratitude and be uh, uh, grateful for everything that you have you do have uh, uh, financial success that is coming and that is something that i mentioned earlier also you do have financial success that is going to come into your life you do have a rich and rewarding family life and uh, you will have materialistic things that will come into your life and new opportunities that that are waiting for you will also come in uh, for some of you you know your since one of your sincere wishes uh, wish might be granted you need to keep your life in balance and this is going to be a period of prosperity and abundance for you all right six of gabriel i mean you guys are beautiful cards Congratu congratulations you have done a wonderful job time to move on to the next project so it's you know you have done a great job you you have been successful you will be successful in whatever you you have undertaken and like i mentioned earlier you know some people might have a promotion also coming in so you some might receive an award or a scholarship or a promotion and this is a time for celebration for you okay and uh, you are going to be rewarded abundantly for uh, all the hard work that you have been doing and it's time for you to release yourself from all the burdensome situations or all the burdens that you have been uh, uh, you know carrying and all your materialistic uh, needs uh, will get fulfilled in a magical and unexpected way but it's time for you to even act with kindness and you know 
there has to be an equal give and receive as well and that is what you know earlier when i said you need to have a balance that is what you need to have a balance about that equal give and take you know where you give and receive with a grateful heart so you need to do that you uh, you know as you open your arms to receive all the you know blessings that are that you are going to be showered with open your arms to give as well you know the more you give the more you will receive will so uh we all have uh, free will and uh, you know uh, this card talks about decisions that requires action and uh, you are in control of your own decision and your own life okay you can't give that power to someone else nobody else can make that decision uh, on your behalf because you that is yours you have a free will which means that you should focus on yourself first and uh, you should not uh, you know let someone else give that that power of free will to someone else okay what you need to do is set healthy boundaries it's very important to set boundaries like i mentioned free will you need to that is yours you know you can't give uh, the right to make a decision on your behalf to somebody else you need to create those hel hel healthy boundaries where you know uh, you don't let people walk over you so you need to create those healthy boundaries and you need to know uh, uh, you know what is it that you need to do when you when you stand for yourself and you teach people how to treat you people will treat you that way don't let people walk over you okay uh, and please take care of your health if you look at this card look at this card look at this girl who's who's in this bubble she looks malnourished please don't uh, you know depend on people saying that go on a diet accept yourself the way you are and create those boundaries look after your health take care of your health uh, eat healthy food discernment so you do have a choice to make uh, like i said your will that is a decision that you need to make and you need to take care of the choices that you know you need to um, uh, make look carefully and judge wisely okay you might not be seeing the truth completely right now but things will unfold things will unfold and that cloud will be lifted up and you will be able to uh, and the truth will be revealed to you that is when you examine it closely and you make a choice and and you take that decision growth so in case you are feeling you know stuck uh, in and and feeling that you know you're stuck and you and that stagnant energy you need to take action you need to make that choice you need to make that take that decision and be ready to you know uh, accept the changes changes is something that we all don't like but you need to accept the changes that are going to come into your life because change is a natural part of our life okay you you cannot resist change forever so be courageous take move forward you have beautiful cards that have come so move forward you have it all so accept those changes what you need to do is surrender to the divine absolutely just surrender like i mentioned earlier it is time to give rather than take you need to have that equal give and take you know uh, you need to have that balance in case you are going through a personal situation that will reach a resolution so a personal situation will be resolved have faith in your dreams so don't give up hope have faith in your dreams let's see what are the blessings that are coming to you compliments from an admirer you are highly thought of somebody must be really thinking about you 
you need to pay attention at work or you will have that peace and harmony that you're searching for you do have a peaceful resolution also oh wow uh recognition and rewards for merit you you this came up twice actually and you okay you do have happiness coming in something important such as a new job or a raise you have a raise your recognition uh, or reward for merit you had here also uh, promotion somewhere else financial success wow. and you have the star energy guaranteed success all right so i'll leave your reading here so that's all i have for you uh, group 2 I hope you resonated to this reading and this messages and I will see you next time for your next reading. Thank you. Welcome group 3 and this is for all those who resonated with the selenite stone. Isn't it beautiful? Okay, as your reading my god the lovers you know when i made groups three groups i i don't know why when i was making the groups and i kept that selenite the selenite stone has group three i somehow knew that this group would have some love messages i mean this is okay the lovers so uh, you need to make uh, choices from your heart and uh, you do have uh, a new love coming into your life currently or you do have an opportunity to renew the love that you already have in your life in case uh, you know uh, you and your partner are not together or if you have an ex this uh, is also an opportunity that you know you might have a reconciliation Uh, believe in the power of love and uh, in case you are in a relationship or entering into a relationship this relationship will have a solid foundation and might even uh, you know turn into can lead into a marriage okay it's an important choice or a decision that you will have to make using your heart so use your heart and uh, be very careful after all it's the matter of your heart oh my god four of gabriel i don't know what is say so in case you are in a relationship or getting into a new relationship or you've been dating somebody for some time uh, you know you might take your relationship to the next level okay and some of you might take your relationship to the next level like you know getting into a committed uh, relationship or might decide to live in together or get engaged or even get married okay it's it's time for celebration and uh, you are going to be uh, you know rewarded for abundantly for all your hard work and you need to release yourself from uh, burden some situation you need to release all your burdens okay you need to believe in yourself and listen to your heart and you need to do what gives you joy what makes your heart sing and uh, you know when i say release yourself from burden some situation you know in case you have a past where you know things were not right release all that regret that you had you know release everything that had happened remember that everything happens for a reason so release the past and and embrace the new opportunity that you're getting for happiness okay so embrace that new happiness that that, that you're going to find in your relationship six of aerial material needs get fulfilled in magical and unexpected ways uh you need to be kind as well and uh, you need to give and receive uh, with a grateful heart because Uh, you are going to be blessed you know with with uh, you are going to be get you are going to be blessed magically 
and there will be a lot of uh, un unexpected financial blessings that you might receive so you need to act also with kindness and the more you give the more you receive it's an equal give and take of, all right and you need to be grateful and even when you give and receive you need to be you you need to do that with a grateful heart you do have lot of uh, you do have opportunities waiting for you and you will uh, there will you will have material things coming into your life you might even uh, get recognition and reward okay uh, at work new beginning wow i love this and that new beginning might be you know in a relationship or it can it might be in any any aspect of your life mm -hmm. and uh, you need to find it's about uh, this card is also about finding your purpose uh, and might be about your new spiritual journey a forgiving and compassionate review of the past like i mentioned here you know everything happens for for a reason you need to release your past and release the regret that you have and you need to do what you love okay so so when you start something new start start your new endeavor with something that you love okay uh some of you might have a new career or a new job or you know uh you all might receive a new in case you're planning to have a baby it can also be about you know uh planning to have a baby or a birth uh, of a new venture or a new opportunity or uh, a new uh, how do i say new business some of you might have get new creative ideas how to take your uh, you know uh, business forward or new ventures forward uh, some of you might receive a fresh new start new start in your relationship as well and they will be uh, you know you will find that peace and harmony in your relationship and in in your life uh, you might receive uh, you know uh, uh, a new job or a or a raise in your job or a promotion like i mentioned earlier and you do have a success that is coming to you and in case you need uh, you know assistance and or guidance it's time for you to ask for that help uh, you know or that assistance uh, some of you might even do a short journey okay which uh, uh some some of you might might even travel and don't worry even if you feel that currently you cannot see things happening but slowly and and surely you will get there you will get there and you will see the changes that are coming into your life but you should be open to accept those changes and another thing that just came to my mind is when we talk about love okay we want a loving relationship focus on yourself also focus on self love love yourself first before giving that love to someone else give that love to yourself first all right the path so the path is lit for you all you need to do is take the courage and take that step forward and move ahead and uh, begin that journey like i mentioned some of you might have that journeys so that journey might be uh, you know uh, the the journey that you take the courageous step forward so move forward you must move forward and be open for the new ways that are that are opening to you the new possibilities that are opening to you boundaries very important very important to set boundaries you need to set boundaries and uh, you know uh, you have to have healthy boundaries and uh, you should not let people walk over you don't let people walk over you don't let people use you don't let people take advantage of your goodness so that's the reason why you need to set healthy boundaries you know it is you who teach people how to treat you so don't complain if 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 people are walking over you when if you don't have boundaries and uh, you need to set healthy boundaries in second is look at this uh, girl in the card look at how she looks skinny bony are you looking after yourself are you eating healthy so look after your health 
surrender beautiful and uh, of course you will get everything when you surrender surrender is not uh, you know um, it surrender does not mean that you know we tell you to give up on something it's not about giving up it is about letting go of something that you no longer have control on we as human we want to control everything we need to be in control of everything but it is, there's a beauty in, in in surrendering so you need to surrender you need to be uh, stop being stubborn and holding on to things or to behavior that don't align with you right now so you need to stop struggling and you need to surrender surrender to the divine faith have faith and uh, you know this card is also about if you see this this uh, woman who's pregnant and that's the mother earth and and that also means new beginning it is it is about new beginning and you need to hold on to your dreams you you need to have faith in your dreams and you need to uh, you know have faith and hope and and not give up hope okay you do have a new romantic cycle that is going to begin that i already said in the beginning somehow i knew that this group is going to have uh romance cards you can still change your decision or you know make a different choice because nothing is is set in stone okay if you don't like something that's happening in your life make a different choice wow another surrender card surrender to the divine you need to surrender and you're very close to achieving your goals you're very close to achieving your goals and you know uh, remember you know when we talk about surrender also you it, it's just you're letting go of things that are no longer in your control you you are remember that you're protected also you're protected from negative forces that are beyond your control and uh, somehow i get this thing that you know uh, uh someone in your life might be behaving very stupidly or someone might that someone might even leave uh you know or go out of your life or there will be an end of a situation which is which is giving you a tough time right now okay so uh just surrender what whatever situation that you're going through because this the situation that you're going through situation requires balance and it, and you need to you know handle that situation carefully and remember things will always not be this way there is a change coming into your life okay things will change into your life all you need to do is surrender let's look at the blessings coming into your life you will be shown the way of course you had the path so of course you will be shown the way the path is also you know where you are uh, shown the way rainbow what did i say things will not remain the same a change is coming the most difficult part of a situation is over boat money or uh, pros- uh, property through an inheritance winning or windfall staff you will be taken care of in a difficult situation and i did mention that you are protected you are protected <laughs> romance celebration party please please tell me okay mention in the comments column or uh, you know uh just uh, dm me or message me on whatsapp some of you all most of you all have my number let me know what is the romance that's happening in your life i would like to know okay so you do have romance celebration and parties you do have success that is coming in some of you will hear some good news and you have the star guaranteed success Okay so I'm going to leave your reading here so that's all I have for you uh, group 3 and uh, I hope you resonated to this reading and to the messages and I will see you next time for your next reading thank you